guys, welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new, I'm Alicia. Today, I decided to go thrifting. Anyway, <laughs> um, I usually shop at like Torrid or just other stores like that, um, just kind of in the mall, that type of thing, even online. And I haven't gone thrifting in a really long time, so I figured, you know what? So why don't I go to the Goodwills in my area and just see if there's anything cool to try on? So that's what I'm doing today. We'll see if I have any good finds, and maybe next time I'll go to Play-Doh's or Clothes Mentor and try those two out. But today I figured let's hit up all the Goodwills in town and see what we come up with. So don't forget to subscribe and like this video, and let's go ahead and start trying on. Okay, you guys, so I really didn't expect expect Goodwill to be this poorly stocked with plus size clothing honestly because I usually give my stuff to like Goodwill or Salvation Army or stuff like that so it just surprises me that there were so little options I don't know if maybe I just went on a bad day or something but like literally I grabbed everything that I possibly could see myself ever wearing maybe this outfit was just too small even though the top was a 2x and the bottoms were in a size 20 the material just wasn't great this was the only outfit that i liked i thought this actually was cute the jeans i think were jessica simpson and uh they were some of the only high-waisted ones i could find there and maybe it's just you know that the goodwills um near my town in peoria illinois just aren't very like well stocked or something but the top I thought was so, so cute, and the bottoms went with it well. Like, I liked the color scheme together. It was very, like, boho chic. So I liked this outfit, and the jeans also were in a size 20, you know, but a lot of the stuff there was, like, a little bit too worn. Like, to the point where I couldn't have bought these jeans because literally I would have had to wear a belt with them because they were so stretched out, which, I mean, is fine, but I just don't like to wear belts. Um, I just thought it was weird that some of the jeans were so stretched out like usually I thought they threw stuff away when it was a little bit too worn um, But I liked this shirt too and this was in a 2x also and I just felt like They had so many like cooler options in the like straight sizes and then when you got to plus size it was literally all like nursing stuff and then just you know like super super old like I don't know, I don't, I don't wanna say old fashioned, but like something that like a, you know, a 60 year old lady would wear rather than like anyone under 40. So <laughs> it was just really hard to shop there, um, which made me realize how lucky I am that I'm able to shop in stores that actually offer like great plus size options, which I mean, that's the thing though, with thrift shopping, it's hit or miss. I mean, you never know what you're gonna get. This was super cool too. This was definitely a Lane Bryant like night dress and it was actually really, really cute. Again, it was just a little bit too worn. Like usually I don't donate my clothes unless they're basically still brand new. Like brand new or like worn a couple of times or even quite a few times. But like if it looks super worn, usually I'll just toss it because I, I thought Goodwill didn't take stuff that was like super, super worn, but turns out they do. Um, yeah, I... I mean, I found, I guess, a couple of good things. So, you know, it's finding that diamond in the rough when you're going thrift shopping. It's not easy, but it is kind of fun because when you do find that outfit, like, you know, you're only paying like $5, so that's pretty cool. This was the second place, um, the second Goodwill I went to, and they did not have lights in their dressing room. And I will talk more about that after I show you guys the footage, but like, look at this. This is terrible. This is hor- what? Who can try on clothes in here and be like, oh, I see what I'm wearing. Like, I felt like I was telling scary stories. Like, huh? I felt like I was camping. It was just really weird. It was really awkward and weird. And I had, as I'm showing you, a lot of other clothes to try on, but like there was no point because it was so dark. You couldn't see anything. I couldn't see anything. Okay guys, so sorry if the air is like super loud, but I just wanted to come on here and say, oh my goodness, what a crap show. Um, so the first Goodwill, was fine nothing special i didn't find anything really cool there this second goodwill literally as you can see in the footage um i haven't edited it yet i'm i literally just went in and came out um i wanted to try everything on but literally the dressing rooms were so dark that i couldn't get good footage one but also like even if i wasn't there to take footage of me trying stuff on 
there's no way that I could have seen myself in the mirror and been like, oh yeah, I want this. Like, it was kind of really dumb. Like, how can you not light up your fitting rooms enough? Like, it was literally like you go into a bathroom and you shut the door and the lights are off. Like, that's how dark it was. It was so annoying. I am like, oh my gosh, I'm steaming right now. Like, just, who the heck does that? What? That's not a way to run a business. Anyway. Anyway, okay. So, those were the only two places I was planning on going were the two Goodwills in my area. Um, because I had just like a little time today to kill and so I figured I would do that. Like I said, kind of awful. Um, I'm hoping that when I do this, I wanna do thrift shopping again. But this time I wanna try out like Play-Doh's and Clothes Mentor and see how that is. So hopefully those places will be a little bit better. But like Goodwill, step up your game. Like it was just, uh, literally they had some good finds. But like I said, too dark. Like you couldn't even try stuff on. It was just annoying. And scene. Okay. Oh, um, I need to calm down. You need to calm down. You need to calm down. Anyway, I need to calm down. <laughs> I'm being too loud. Okay, no, stop it, Alicia. Down, girl, down. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> I am going to go ahead and end this here then. So don't forget to subscribe and like this video if you did enjoy it. Um, let me know what other fashion videos you guys want to see, and I will see you guys in my next one.